everyone. Today we are in the garage. So I've gone out and purchased a unit off Facebook Market Page and I got it quite cheap and we're gonna restore it, do it up and hopefully make it look really good to suit in my new home. So I've gone out, obviously picked it up, picked up all the bits and pieces that I need to be able to restore this unit. Um, I will do a nice close up and while I'm obviously restoring it, I'll have you on time. What's it called? The time lapse, whatever it's called. Um, so you can see me doing it. I'll stop, in it, stop off at every section that I'm changing up what I'm doing, just to let you know what I'm going in to do next. So yeah, we'll go in, have a close up of the unit, show you what it looks like before I obviously start restoring it. And then I'll show you the bits and pieces that I'll be using today to create this unit. First time ever doing this, so wish me luck and um, hope you enjoy my video. So here, so here we have the unit. So it's, oh, I can't even remember the measurements of it. I think it's one by 1.5 meters long. Um, oh, I can't remember how tall it is, but the previous person must have already put a quote coat of um, paint on top of it. So we're just going to go in gently um send this the like pretty much like the shine off it um so we'll do that and take the knobs off it change up the colors so the products i'm using today obviously sander main thing um i've got different ahead so the actual sandpaper so i'm going to use an 180 to just get the shine try to get the shine off and then finish it off with these ones are 400 so that's pretty much, I know, smooth. Smooth, smooth, makes the paint nice and smooth. Um, colors I've chosen, decided on are these white night paints. I got these from Bunnings. Obviously everything, actually everything, all the products I've used today are from Bunnings. So we're going in with the satin gold, flat black. So, and then I haven't decided on the knobs yet. I've got a few bigger head knobs, also some smaller ones. So we're gonna go in, try those first. Um, yeah, so this is it before. Like I said, I'll stop off and of every section that I'm changing up and let you know what I'm doing next. Great, see you soon. Okay, so I'm back in the garage. Um, I've done all the spray painting of the gold around the trimmings. So I'll just pick up one and show you. So just around the edge of the, um, of the drawers. So done all that. Now I'm gonna peel off the tape and we're gonna go in and paint the actual whole unit now in the black. So I've just decided on painting it instead of spray paint so i oh know i just had a funny moment where i was like spray painting's a bit of a mess um go tape it all up so i thought giving it a go of the paint i went into bunnings and bought um i don't know i just asked them what to get so this is a low sheen black 
um, I, I think it's wool paint. I'm not too, not too sure. I just asked them what I needed for it and redo a unit. So go and paint that on and yeah, show you the finished project when I'm done. Here's the finished piece. So I'll do a nice close up of it so you can see what I've done. So black all over with the gold trimmings. Really, really like it. And Voss. Vossie, what are you doing? So very happy with it. Didn't take too long to do. I'm sure everyone will be able to do it themselves. So thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe um, and like and even comment on my videos would be great. Thank you.